folks welcome back to my channel so let's just preface this video is going to be very like chill as you can tell i i mean i, I look great i had to not wear my glasses because they don't match these earrings so i'm a bit blind but we can just ignore that um but like it's it's just very casual as you can tell because i'm filming a playlist video i just wanted to like make a video where i was just having a chat as though i was just chatting to my friends which that's what I want to do with this channel, so here I am, um, and yeah, I thought that I would just talk a bit about some of the music that I've been really liking recently, because here's where it gets deep for a second, um, music just means, like, a lot to me, and it's helped me get through some tough times, you know, like, yeah, I just really like music and so I thought that I would share with you some of the songs that I've been liking if you too like music and want to discover some new songs or just find out what I like listening to um, at the moment my Spotify is always in the description it's just my old channel name so two eyes at the end of Nikki so I've got a list on my phone um, we are very prepared for this video so the first song is Old Town Road by Lil Nas X <laughs> Wow, I just probably butchered that but I particularly like the remix with Billy Ray Cyrus like that verse that really does is honestly Brilliant at first. I thought this song was really weird But then I listened to it more and more and now like I just I love it so much The next song is you need to calm down by Taylor Swift. There will be a few Taylor Swift songs in here I do love me some Taylor Swift um, and as of like when I'm filming this, her new album like isn't out yet, so I don't know about any other songs on that, but I really like this song, I like the message behind it, and actually I watched a video, I think it was by Insider, I think, on YouTube, where like they dissected the song and the music video, um, and like talked about hidden messages behind it and whatever, and I was just there like, mind equals blown, like, wow. There is so many like little tiny details and I don't know if she like thought about them or whether they're just coincidental but honestly like amazing um, and the song is pretty chill too so yeah pretty chill who am I? This next song is a bit more like quirky um, I surprise myself more and more every day by the stupid stuff that comes out of my mouth um, but it's Little Help by I think it's Boss Hoss feet Mimi and Josie and it's the Mimi and Josie part that I really like so basically this has a little bit of a backstory to it so Mimi and Josie were two girls who were on The Voice Kids Germany I will link the video down below in the description box if you take anything from this video please go and watch it it's honestly amazing they auditioned with a cover of Creep by Radiohead and it is the most beautiful thing I have ever heard it's so like chilling but like it's just wow like honestly wow um so since i found that video i just followed their journey they ended up winning obviously because they were literally amazing and boss hoss were like their mentors on the voice you know how they have like yeah um so they ended up releasing a song together and that is this song next one is a classic truth hurts by lizzo um i mean i'm a hundred percent that bitch even when okay yeah um, so I just, I love this song still, like, I'm, it's a, it's a great song, isn't it? It's very, like, empowering. This next one is Claudia by Phineas. So, again, a bit of a backstory, Phineas. So Claudia Salewski, I have watched her on YouTube for a while. I love her videos, they're great. Um, and I knew she had a boyfriend called Phineas and I was like cool chill whatever um and then I found out that this dude was Billie Eilish's brother and I was just like what um but yeah he wrote a song about Claudia I don't know why I just went into that whole anyway he wrote a song about Claudia and um yeah it's it's a really really beautiful song another Taylor Swift one new romantics this song just like wow like it is so vibey and I'm about to say vibey probably a lot during this video but that is the kind of music that I like like I have a playlist called all the feels on my Spotify and that is like my favorite type of music it's just music that makes you like feel a certain kind of way and like just feel like happy and like fluttery inside um and new romantics is like 
one of the best songs for that. It is so overlooked because it was on her, um, which album was it on actually? 1989 I think, but it was on the deluxe version and honestly it should have been a single because it's amazing, but not many people like talk about it or anything, so yeah. Billie Eilish herself is up next. So I love Billie Eilish, honestly, like so many of her songs I absolutely adore, but I obviously couldn't just mention them all. So one of my favorites is Bellyache. I really, really love that song. This next one is another like quirky one. Um, it's Be Mine by Offenbach, I think it is. Let me, let me find it. This song I discovered through Scam Italia, which is a TV show that I was watching. Um, and they played it in it. It's probably like, I like a lot of songs probably because of the association that I have of the song with like other things that I really like. But it's, it's a pretty good song. They had like a good soundtrack in that movie. Um, not movie, it's a TV show, Meg, to <laughs> keep up. Next song is again from that TV show. Um, as I said, they had a great soundtrack. It's Chlorine by Birth with two H's. Um, this is like a very, it's kind of like a dark song, but it's also very, very pretty. Like it's just a really nice kind of sad song. Sometimes you just need to listen to some sad songs. <laughs> Again, Billie Eilish, um, Bad Guy is another one of my favorites. It's just, how can you not like this song? It's so like catchy. Another song that perfectly fits the vibes kind of music variety that I like um, is The Moment by Tame Impala. It's just so vibey. I need to stop saying, I'm so sorry, um, but yeah, I also really like The Less I Know The Better, but I've stopped listening to that song as much because I kind of ruined it for myself. Like, that's what I do with songs, which really annoys me. Like, I just listen to them so much and, like, completely ruin them for myself. Another more obscure one is High by, I believe, Pecking Duck. <laughs> um, it's a very, it's a very, like, upbeat song. It's perfect for summer, I think. Next song is Feel It Still by Portugal The Man. I, they have a good few songs that I really like. Um, this one is probably my favorite. I was obsessed with it last year and it's still really a great song. So yeah, <laughs> this next song was my summer anthem last year. Honestly, I annoyed so many of my friends with this. They literally hated me. We were walking around Madrid um, because we went to Madrid together and I was just singing it in the street so I'm really sorry to anyone in Madrid who heard me because I can't sing but it's Hard Times by Paramore like it's so good I don't know why I like it so much because it is kind of like a weird song but it's very different and it's just so catchy and it's so true <laughs> um, and it really like you can it's it's very a applicable to my life in a lot of situations <laughs> so yeah I just really like that song and I still really love it so go listen to it next one is by Mabel and it's don't call me up it's a great song it's very like upbeat I really like it this next one really really hits home um, so it's Happy by Julia Michaels. Number one, Julia Michaels is literally such a gem of a human being. She is so like lovely and down to earth and her songs are so like raw and real. So if you haven't listened to her, go listen to her songs. Um, but Happy is honestly amazing. Like it's such a gorgeous song. And it's also like parts of it I just relate to so much basically the chorus. Next song is Natural by Imagine Dragons. So Imagine Dragons have a lot of songs that I really like. Um, I wouldn't say like I listen to them loads anymore. I used to listen to them quite a lot. I discovered it a lot more recently and it's such a good song. Like, ah, it's very, it's a lot more like packs a punch, you know? Okay, anyway, it's, it's a lot more like a mmm song, but I, I, do, I do like me some mmm songs, you know? Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna stop that now. Next one is Extreme Ways by Moby. This song, you probably don't know, because it is, it was my dad's, or it is my dad's, one of my dad's favourite songs, basically. And I remember growing up listening to this song quite a lot, um, and when I finally 
got old enough to realise like, oh, I like this song, I can like download it and listen to it for myself. Um, yeah, I've been listening to it quite a lot. It's a very like vibey song. Yeah, I really like it. I'm not sure it's everyone's cups of ev I'm not sure it's everyone's cup of tea, but I like it. The next song I've been listening to a lot as of the past few days, and it is Cheetah Tongue by the Wombats. It's so like all the feels, you know, all the feels from this song. It is amazing. I honestly love it so much. Um, I've been playing it on repeat a lot, so unfortunately I think I'm going to get sick of it within the next few days, but while it lasts, like honestly, it's fabulous. Another great uplifting song is Sunday Best by Surfaces. This is from Laura Medley's intro on YouTube um, from a while ago, and yeah, it's just, I remember listening to it in the last term of uni and <laughs> trying to like tell myself that everything's gonna be okay and like, I'm happy. Um, but it's a very like, you know, upbeat, cheerful, happy song. The next song on the list is You Were Right by Rufus Du Sol. I probably said that wrong. Um, but this is again a very vibe song. Um, I literally, I'm so sorry for this video. <laughs> um, if there's anyone still watching it. Um, but yeah, I really, I really enjoy this song. I listen to it from time to time. So at least I'm not sick of it, and it's it's a very nice song. Ah, the next one. Okay, so this song is um, honestly amazing. I don't think I could ever get sick of this. It is so, it's the most beautiful song I think I've ever heard. It's one of those songs that you probably have like heard somewhere and you know you like it, but like you don't know what it is. Um, it's Midnight City by M83. Honestly, the most genius, like, melody I think I've ever heard. Next up is Lana Del Rey. Um, I love a lot of her songs. I listened to them a lot when I was revising for my uni exams this year. One of the songs that I really love is National Anthem by Lana Del Rey. It's really a very pretty song, again. My friend was also obsessed with it, so she kind of got me obsessed with it. Okay, so this next one is a shocker. Um, so I heard this song. And I was like, okay, I like it, I'll like search up what it is. And I find like what the song is, and I'm just like, what? The actual hell. It is Kiwi, but it's by Harry Styles. And when you hear the song, honestly, it doesn't sound anything like, okay, it sounds a bit like him, but it's so different to what I'm used to hearing from him. I was just like, shooker. Next song is You and Me. Um, this is by I Will Tell You When I Find Out. I probably should have put who actually send me songs on this list, but it's by Disclosure Eliza Doolittle and it's the Flume remix. Um, it is again from Scamitalia. They had a good soundtrack um, and it's a very like, again, feels song and you know, like beat drop. Another one of my current absolute obsessions besides Cheetah Tongue is Out of My League. So this is by Fitz and the Tantrums, I want to say. I think it's Tantrums or Tantrum. Um, and my sister introduced me to this song and it's honestly amazing. Again, a very vibey song. Again, I love it. Again, I'm probably going to get sick of it in the next few days, but another one of my dad's favourites that has rubbed off on me is The Pretender by Foo Fighters. So this is a song that if you're feeling a bit angry, <laughs> um, if you just have a lot of like pent up emotions and whatever those emotions may be, um, this is a great song to just shove on and like have like a vigorous jump around to like it is such a good like shake everything out of your system song um not that i'm angry <laughs> or anything but yeah i i really like this song it's very like melodic but at the same time very like mm -hmm, in your face kind of like is it rock i don't know and the last song is church which is by um again i sam henshaw feet earth gang okay so this song is a brilliant song to probably put on in the morning because I mean it literally says like wake up in it but like it's a very like feel good happy like uplifting upbeat song um, and it's also very like 
feelsy at the same time so you know the perfect combination and that is all the songs for today this is probably gonna change in like three or four weeks but at this current moment in time these are some of my absolute favorite songs i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you found some new songs that you might like or just enjoyed listening to me ramble about how much i love certain songs um, as you can tell, my music taste is very all over the place. Like, I don't like any one particular genre. Just any song that, like, gives me good vibes is the A plus from me. I'm not sure whether anyone actually wanted to watch this, but I thought that I would make it anyway, um, because I want to make it. So, yeah, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, um, and that is it for today. So I will see you in my next video. Bye!